Hello, it's Sarah, and this is my last page of Journal Soup 2. It's, um, well, I put the, it's the little things that make life big, but it was super fun. We, um, did a, a sprays page. Um, I actually used a piece of, I got this for, um, coloring with Copics. It's the um, Mina Solar White cardstock. I just wanted to try something different, a different kind of paper. Um, a lot of you guys have been saying um, to do the sprays with a gessoed background, so I have this prepped for another, when I play again, um, I put some gesso on this. It's just a piece of file folder. Um, and we'll see the difference. But um, I didn't gesso it, and it, it, it did... I'm talking about the owls. It did do some resist. I mean, I don't have it. I cut it up. Where the heck did I put the other part? Here. You can see some of the ghosting, though. This was the opposite side of the ghosting. I think I actually used the piece with the owl, um, this big owl, but then it gets all covered up. And I stamped on top of it and everything. Um, but all of these owls were from the same piece of this paper. I just picked out different pieces and all you did was, <clears throat> it's a very simple little owl to make. She teaches you how to do it. Um, and then I ended up doing a couple purple ones out of those tags that I had done the other day. Um, and they're much darker. Um, so I, I tend to be a dark person. Um, but, uh, they were so fun to make, so I'll probably be putting them on, um, a journal page in the future. Um, the only thing I forgot to do was to change their, the direction of their eyes. Like, I didn't have any with the, looking off to the side or cross-eyed or anything different. I, they're all looking straight ahead. And they're all the, the exact same way, too. So, I mean, I, I'm gonna have to doodle and try some different, um, shapes and stuff. I finally did do, like little feathers on his belly instead of doing dots and um, that's about it though. I mean I did put some lines on his wings instead of dots. But they're cute. So then, and for the background, this is just another piece of um, cardboard and um, it, it's a gessoed background. We did a little bit of collage. That's why I put this um, washi tape, the music washi tape, because you c there's a little bit of music paper under there. There's a little bit of the Tim Holtz, um, like the plans, the um, the architectural plans, but I covered up the other piece of music paper. So, um, but I just thought this washi tape. This is like <clears throat> a new washi that I got. It's just got pink, dark pink, light pink, yellow, and there's like a tiny bit of blue. But I really thought it matched, and I just wanted to use it. So I used this really thick black, and white and put that underneath and put that and like kind of just layered them um but yeah it's the same kind of background oh i carved this stamp i'm loving this stamp carving stuff um i showed you guys the uh oh look i did this one i did a smiley face he didn't come out that great but these two are pretty cool and that's what i used on here the one, this one has like the inside cut out, and then this one's just solid, but it didn't come out too solid. But, um, super fun, because Kate had ones like that. I showed you my, um, breast cancer awareness one. So this whole series of classes was, I learned so much and got so relaxed, and I just had fun. I honestly just had fun. So I have this whole big box of goodies all these different techniques i learned this is journal soup one so i want to do some more angels similar similar little people like that and similar to her i want to do some more of this one remember that one i'm gonna do some more of these i think little angels um just too fun uh, so, let's see, that was it. It was about maybe 10, 
There were six pieces, seven including the title page. One, two, oh yeah, and there's one over there on display, my house, I'll go get it. Um, so yeah, so tomorrow I'm going to be doing clay. I'm definitely planning on that, but this was the one, a house is made of walls and beams, a home is made of love and dreams. I like this one, we painted this one on. Um, so I, I am like, this background, I, I like them both. I really do. I don't have a problem. Oh, I stamped my leaves. The leaves stamp that I have, where are they? Um, they're in the water. I put them in the water because I put paint on them. So I'm going to clean my water in a minute. But they got all painty. So I carved them. But I have the leaves in yellow. They're small one, small one, or big one, small one's big one. And I didn't have an, any orange, so I stamped the orange in the vermilion um, ink. But it was super fun. I'm excited. This, You guys, honestly, if you're struggling with mixed media, you won't be after the, these classes. They're so great. She's such a good teacher. And it's fun. It's just easy and whimsical and no pressure. Like, it's just, honestly, it was so amazing. So... Um, that's it, and I'll be back tomorrow with some clay. Thanks for watching.